Now, the Senior Staff Association of Nigeria Universities, also SANU, and uh, Non Academic Staff Union have uh, declared a seven day ultimate nationwide industrial action at the University of Illawarra, causing gridlock and also stranding uh, work, stranded workers and students. The unions have issued ultimatums to the federal government to pay salary arrears and earn allowances, uh, which have been paid to one out of four unions. We have discovered as Nigerians that the only language that our government understands most from the labor union is the language of the strike. And uh, that's why we are speaking to them in that language that they mostly you know, understand. So the situation of uh, compliance in the University of Illinois, you can see for yourself where you are coming from the gate, you can see that uh, the university is not bubbling like it used to be. And that is to tell you that uh, our members have done too. They are not on their duty post as directed by the national leadership of Jack, of Sano and Nasu. The release of our four months with test salary, which a section of the university, one union out of four unions in the university has been paid. As you. you can see that this is a kind of an aberration. When there are four unions in the university and only one is being paid, and all this union went to strike at the same time for the same purpose and for the same reason. And the salary was withheld for the same purpose, for the same reason. So it is to our surprise that only one union will not be paid without any explanation from the government quarters why our own has not been paid. We were neglected, we were, we, we were abandoned by the government. And it's like they are telling us to do our worst. We have been having a total um, compliance of our members. This morning we had a congress at the main campus gate where we directed all our members to go back home and observe the seven days warning strike. The warning strike was not far-fetched from the fact that um, we wanted to allow the government to know that there is what we call divide and rule, and they should not be using that divide and rule to um, destabilize the, the academic uh, atmosphere of the university. Now students are preparing for their first semester exams have called on the federal government to address union demands and prevent a further academic crisis. I to appeal to them to let the students round up their examinations before they continue the action. Seriously, it's affecting us presently now because I should be in school by now writing my exams. I've been lying up here, it's more than maybe 30 or 45 minutes now. They try their best for us not to have any form of strike again. Everything about the strike, they should set to everything I and mean, within that. Now, normal university campus activities have been altered. But one industrial action is expected to last seven days if the federal government fails to engage union leadership in dialogue to address demands. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.